All right, this is my older Suriname boa constrictor. Red tail, this is her nice big cage. She's usually up there, but right now she's cooling off on the lower cool side. You can see her right there. I put the rat in there just a little bit to pique her interest and get her to come out. I would rather her not strike from right there because she's wrapped up behind here and she's not gonna get a very good strike. So I'm gonna try and drag her out a little bit. She's currently on a large frozen thawed rat every three weeks. Generally, she would be getting a large frozen thawed rat every four weeks. But from August until November, she gets them every three weeks. With right before her fasting time, she gets them back to back two weeks in a row. That's not common. I do not suggest that long term. That's just before she fasts for the winter time. Oh, they're gonna have to get that. Great. I want to stick my hand in there. Fake plants are great, but sometimes they get in the way. Alrighty. Definitely not the smoothest video I've ever done, but here we go. So as I said, this side is more of a cool side. Um, her hot hide area is up there. Her hot basking area is there and there. This is the coolest spot in the whole cage. Right now it's about 76. During the winter it'll get down to 72, 73. Over there's kind of medium. But as I said, she was on large rats every four weeks from March until August and then from August till November she gets them every three weeks with the exception of the last month I do two weeks so they get two she gets two meals back to back not back to back but at the beginning of uh, October and the end of October so then she will fast from November until the end of February it's worked out great. She's definitely going to be smaller than the other uh, red, the Surin, um, ah, the other BCC that I have. But I also got her a lot later. I didn't get her when she was a baby. She was already four foot ten at four years old when I got her, and she's about six foot one or six foot two at five and a half. So she's grown pretty close to an inch a month on this feeding program, despite being somewhat small at four years old, but she's growing wonderful. She's staying lean, she's very muscular. She'll probably be the smallest out of the three BCC, but she's beautiful and she's got a great appetite. It's hard to believe that the first month or two that I had her, how much of a pain in the butt she was with feeding. She would only eat it if I left it in there for her, but now she's one of my best eaters. So I'm gonna leave her alone. She'll probably come from down there up into here later tonight so she can be up in the heated area to digest. But as always, guys, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. If you like what you saw and you want to see more, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Share if you want to. If you guys have any questions or concerns, don't hesitate to tell me about it in the comment section below. I'll be happy to get back to you as soon as I can. All right, everyone be safe and thank you for the support.